What's up guys, it's me Bruce Lee. Today we're taking a look at Adopt.me's latest update, the inventory and backpack update. Guys, this is such an epic update because it has changed our inventory forever. But guys, before we get started, if you want to enter my giveaways and be in the draw to win potions, pets, and even Robux, all you need to do is leave a like, subscribe, and comment down below your Roblox username. It's all you need to do to enter. Okay, I'm gonna see if you can do that before we hit the floor. Are you ready for this, guys? Okay, let's go. Three, two, one. Okay, we'll run down. Oh no, what? Run down, fall down, drop down. Starburst is being a litchy. We just face planted in the floor. Did you leave a like and subscribe? Oh my gosh, you did? Thank you so much. You're now part of the pretzel army and you're in the draw to win any of my giveaways. But if you want an extra entry, all you need to do is look for every single hidden pink pretzel that's going to be popping up throughout this video. Just like this one right here. And if you get the amount correct, you have an extra entry to win. But to start off with you guys, we need to take a look at the backpack. So already our first tab, our brand new tab is our Favorite. So here we have all of our favorited items and already guys I've favorited Starburst because she is our favorite pet our favorite item in the backpack She is a neon unicorn but guys also I favorited some of the most used toys that I use so I use the grappling hook and propeller quite a lot Especially to like get up in the sky when I'm filming and then also the lemonade and hot dog stand when I'm on a public service So I favorited those four for just some easy access now if we go into pets we can see that some of the pets are stacked, whereas some of them aren't, even if they're the exact same pet. Well, the way that this is all working is if a pet is the exact same name, the exact same rarity, fly or ride, or not fly or ride, if it has the same name, if it's just got everything the same, it will stack just like the albino monkeys here. And this one is meant to stack, but there's a few bugs that they're still working on. Eggs will stack as well, just like we've got all of these Aussie eggs right here, guys. 23 Aussie eggs and they're all stacked because they haven't got a different name. They haven't got a different level So like they can't go from unhatched to almost hatched or like newborn to junior or something Whereas we've got these five dodos and they've all got different stuff Like if we click on this this dodo has a different level to this dodo and this dodo has a different name to this dodo And this dodo is wearing clothes so none of these are stacked because they've all got different stuff. You can see the farm eggs have stacked. We've got two normal newborn king bees that have stacked. And we've just got a couple of pets that have stacked and a couple of pets that haven't. Like our neon peacocks and stuff, guys. Our 12 skelly rexes here because I haven't even touched them, guys. <laughs> They're all newborn. And then we've got the snow owls and so on. And when you favorite an item or a pet, it actually comes up with like all this orange shining lights and then there's stars coming from the floor, which is really awesome. So we favorited Starburst. So all of this is just stars and stuff. It's so awesome. And if we go down into the backpack, we can see some of our bees have stacked and the pets, you know, some of them are stacked, some of them aren't. So it's still a little bit messy, guys. But look, it's just so much easier to scroll through. Like usually there would be about two pages of lunar oxes, but now, there's only like four little slots. If we go into petware though, all of this is stacked. So if they can stack, they can. But if they're being used, they take up separate inventory slots. So that's pretty much all it is for here. There's no other stuff because you can't really like alter petware or anything. But if it's being used, it'll be in a different slot than the rest. If we go into strollers, it's pretty much just everything is stacked. Everything is stacked unless it's a different color. That's all it is. Food is the exact same. Everything is stacked unless it's got different uses. So we know that if we equip a food item, we can eat it like five times. Like we take five bites of this pie. But now the items are different. So this blueberry pie went from the five uses left to the four uses left, which is like five bites versus four bites. So then that's the same with everything. So some of these will take up different inventory slots. Like here we've got hot dogs with two uses and hot dogs with one use. 99 plus. 99 plus guys Adomi is changing out the 99 plus to being the exact number but guys we've even got over over 200 lemonade that's that's certain that we've got over 200 lemonade which is actually really really crazy and we have way over 200 hot dogs which i thought i thought we would have like 150 definitely not 200 vehicles is the exact same as the strollers they're all stacked unless they're different colors like if we go down here we can actually see the colors as well if we hover our mouse over it let's head outside of here but we've got the muscle car this one is black and these two are pink so if we equip it look there's the black one 
and this one's the pink one, which is really good because then you don't have to go through, let's say you've got like five muscle cards all with different colors. You don't have to go through every single card to find the right color. You just hover your mouse over it and it shows you the color automatically, which is pretty cool. But stuff that can't have different colors, stuff that's like already a color, like the golden scooter, that's that stacks, clown unicycle, that stacks, that sort of stuff, that all stacks. Toys is the exact same as vehicles and stuff. If it's a different color, which I don't think you can do with toys. I don't think toys can be a different color. So everything just stacks here un unless it is a different color or it's being favorited. That's the same with everything. So if something's favorited, it will leave the stack and become its own. And then gifts, everything stacks. But also Adopt Me has actually changed it because there's a different little slot here. They had to completely make a new page of slots. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight different slots that we can have different items in. And guys, Adobe wouldn't just add two pages. They wouldn't add a whole extra page if there was only going to be two items here. So guys, I think Adopt Me is adding a whole new section really soon, or they're planning on adding multiple sections. My idea is that it could be neon, so a whole section for all of your neon pets, a whole section for your fly ride pets, a whole section for your fly pets, for your ride pets, and everything like that. That would be amazing. I just want to quickly check. I don't think you can, but if we search up fly, will it come up with? No, it won't come up with all of our fly pets, which is a little bit annoying. I thought that could work. And also when we hover our mouse over the plus signs, it says get more adopt pets at the nursery. And I just love how there's like a new thing. Like it just, it, I kind of like it more than like the old color, like bulk color one. I really, really like this because it shows you its name. Oh, it shows you it's the normal pet's name, it's role play name, it's age, and what it's rarity is, which is pretty much the same as the old type. But I still think that this is definitely better than the old one. I just think it looks cooler. But let's go, let's take a look at the better backpack update. So this is their game notes. Here we have item stacking. This change will be most helpful to players with large messy inventories and players with mobile or older devices as it should help with the performance issues. So like the lag and stuff because Adopt Me actually loads when you come into the game. The reason it might be taking longer is because Adopt Me changed it. So when you first load into the game, it loads every single pet on different times. So it doesn't load like all of your dogs at once. It loads them like one for one for one. So if you're like me and it's been taking a while to get into Adopt Me, like, like for me, maybe it will take like half an hour to load into Adopt Me. A couple of times it's been good though, but it's just been really, really laggy and that's why, because Adopt Me has to load in every single one of your pets and items and food items and stuff. Which, uh, yeah, I guess that would be probably why it's taking so long for me to load into Adopt Me, because we have over 200, <laughs> over 200 hot dogs. <laughs> that's crazy. But guys, all items are able to stack only if they're the exact same. So like what we said earlier, same color, same age, same flyable or rideable. No, there's a bit Visual bug players discover where legendary pets won't stack together, but appear to be on the same aging stage. We're working on a fix for that, but it's actually a bug separate to this update. So like we were talking about the albino monkeys at the top of the backpack, they're not stacking even though they should, so Adopt Me still fixing little bugs like that. Favourite items will never stack, which means that you can favourite a pet and it will stand out making it separate from the stacks. That's awesome. So like I said earlier guys, also this means that items like food and potions will be separately added to your favourites category. We might change this in the future depending on your feedback, so please let us know what you think. Adopt Me, anybody who like knows Adopt Me or the Adopt Me developers, uh, my idea is that if you favourite a food item, have it come up in your favourites as the full stack of stuff. Because I tried to favorite the hot dogs because I feed my pets hot dogs and lemonades quite a lot. So I thought, oh, that'll be easy if it's in the favorites tab. But you won't want to favorite just one, like favoriting one lemonade, you'll only be able to use that once. But favoriting the whole stack means it will be there every time you open up your backpack, just for ease of use. That's my idea. Let me know if you guys think the same thing down in the comments below. I would love it to just have the full stack of food in our backpack, or we have the options to favorite the full stack, or just to favorite them one by one on individually when we when we click that favorites button. And then the tool tip. Clicking on an item now brings up a new description box filled with information about that item. You can press and hold an item to equip the item instantly. When I first was playing the update, I was like, oh come on, I've really got to click and then click again. But it is so good that you can just hold down and that's just so much easier. It's gonna take a little bit of getting used to, but you just have to hold it down and it pops next to you. And also, am I the only person who didn't notice that your pet's actually like, 
pop up in a cloud of smoke. Look, Starburst will pop up in a cloud of smoke. Boom. That's actually really cool. I think that came with the pet emotions update and I just didn't see it. Uh, whoopsies. <laughs> so that's the notes, guys. Every single thing that's coming to the update. And I think it's a pretty good update, though. I really, really like it. And I think it's just going to be easier to sort through the backpack. And have the best day ever. Peace.